tonight's contest, the Kansas City Royals take on the Colorado Rockies. You know, Tim, I was watching last night this nature show, uh -huh. and it was on... Love those. Yeah, well, it was on chimpanzees. Oh. And I found it fascinating that one chimpanzee can eat three times its body weight in bananas. That's Wait, how, a fascinating... In how long a period? In a day. In it a may, day? It might have been an hour. Oh, Jimmy, you mean... eat bananas all the time. You know, you must have misheard. It must have been a week. There's no way. Tim, did that, you see, wait, what, did you see the program? That would did be like you, you the eating 100 did pounds of steak program? in a day, Did you Jimmy? see the program? I did not. All right, then I win. Hello again, everybody. Tim Kitcho from my partner, Jimmy Shorts. And, Jimmy, we have got a doozy for you today. Hey, you're looking a little tired there, partner. Uh, I'm having trouble with my tooth. I'm really hard. I'm not sleeping. Well, yeah, sorry to hear about that, partner. Anyway, now it's time to play ball. You don't care. And here's the batter to lead things off. He's about three feet off the ground right now. He's going to go out there and talk it over with the pitcher. No outs. A man on base. There's a shot. Second base. Pierre rounding second. Out. One out. Man on first. Walker stands in. <laughs> Hitting the air to right field. And he puts it away. Rose to first. He got him. And that's a double play. Ah, uh, Tim, I'll tell you, there's a textbook example of how you turn a double play. After one half inning of play, we are scoreless. Today's breaking a sweat play of the day is brought to you by Sport Water. Try their new Mississippi Black Water or the original Yellow River Sport Water. Who asks, is it coming out of you? And here comes the first batter to lead off the inning. And now the pitch, and he'll make the play. One out. Bases are empty. It's sharply, but foul. Perez takes a cold strike, 0-2. Is he going to swing or is he going to watch? And he laces one over the shortstop. And Hollinsworth reels it in. Two outs, nobody on base. Number 15, Carlos Beltran. Releases. And he gets hit by the pitch. Good thing he's wearing his helmet because he just took a noodle buster to the noggin. And so there are two outs and a runner at first base. And he ropes one over the second baseman's head. And Walker puts it away to retire the side. And that ends the inning. After an inning of play, we are tied at zero. Here's a patriotic question. Why aren't baseballs made in America? Probably the same reason you won't shut your mouth, Jimmy. I don't know. I don't have a clue. And here comes the batter to lead things off this inning. Delivers. And that's line foul. The pitch. Drives one to left center. And he pulls it down. That was a gimme. 
One out. Bases are empty. And he lifts this one to right field. He makes the grab. There are two outs. Base is empty. Japan, the windup. Sends up a drive, center field. And Beltran pulls it in to end the frame. And that ends the top half of the inning. Today's How Far Did That Ball Go Anyway winner will be chosen after the game. Brought to you by the folks at Cheap Seats Airlines. You'll like our fares, they're cheap. Like you, you've never seen a cheaper looking seat. That's coming up a bit later. And here comes the batter to the plate to lead off the inning. Holds up on the pitch out of the strike zone. What a way to wait for your pitch. Line smash into left field. Quinn rounds first. And Quinn is on second with a double. No outs, man on second. Hit hard, right side. Quinn, round third. Guns it to the plate. And Randa winds up at second with a double. No outs, men on second and third. Ibanez takes a cold strike. Owen wins the count. You know, uh, Tim, I'll tell you, I, I was reading an article on this kid. I guess he was born with a shorter leg, and he's overcome some big hurdles, so God bless him. It's sharply, but foul. Line shot over the first baseman's head, and he'll make the play. Fires to second. Out. The throw to third. And that's two. Oh, that is beautiful. That is a double beautiful executed play. Two outs and a runner at third base. Sends up a drive left field. And Hollinsworth pulls it in. And that'll do it for the bottom half of the inning. After two innings, we are tied at zero. Tim, can you remember your first game? Oh yeah, I took a uh, foul ball off the noggin. My dad gave me a quarter to stop crying. And here's the batter to lead things off. Number two, Jose Ortiz. And he wasn't fooled by that pitch out of the zone. And this guy is working the count very nicely. Fly ball, foul territory. Fires, and he looks at the pitch off the plate. Now that pitch was close, Jimmy, and if he laid off that one, you know he's seen the ball well. Ground smash toward the hole. Perez fields it on the bounce. Out at first. One out, bases are empty. The pitch. Hit hard, third base. And Randa puts it away. There are two outs. The base is empty. Patrick takes a cold strike. 
You know, good thing he didn't swing at that one. He might have actually hit something for once. Hit hard, second base. And Supan makes the catch for the final out. Going to the bottom of the third, we are scoreless. Tim, when you get back to the hotel, uh, do you like to swim? I like relaxing in the lounge with a big bowl of peanuts, Jimmy. And here comes the batter to lead things off this inning. center field and Pierre pulls it down one out nobody on base good eye there on the pitch outside I can't tell if he's genius here or if he's just afraid to swing And that's lined over the second baseman. And he puts it away. Routine play. He just needs to hit it where there aren't any fielders. Then he can get the base. And he wasn't fooled by that pitch out of the zone. This kid is really, for once in his life, listening to his hitting coach, and it's starting to pay off here. Delivers. Line shot to third. He makes the grab. And that'll retire the side. With three innings in the books, we are tied at zero. Well, I tell you, fans, I had the best steak last night. I, have you ever noticed how sharp steak knives are in a restaurant? Jimmy, you can gut the hull of an oil tanker with one of those steak knives. They are sharp rondo. Japan winds up. Hit in the air to left. Guns it to first. He is safe. No out. A man on base. Quinn makes the catch. Walker, nothing doing today. Fly it out his last at bat. One out, runner at first base. Gets under it to left field. And he pulls it down. Routine fly ball, easily handled. Two outs, one on. Japan, and here's the windup, and he blows one by. What happens, Jimmy, is you get down on yourself after a few big swing and misses, and uh, it'll stay with you. He's got to shake this off and just get his head back in the game. Pitch on the way. Belts one to left. And Knobloch catches it for the final out. And that'll do it for this half inning. And so in the middle of the fourth, we are scoreless. Tim, what is in a resin bag? Is it raisins or resin? What is resin? Actually, Jimmy, I believe it's red sand. It's uh, found in most uh, breath mints. And here's the batter to lead things off. Beltran takes a called strike. The count is 0-1. Looks like Tim, he's waiting for a pizza delivery guy. You know, he's got to start swinging or else he's going to be the pizza delivery guy. Hit hard right side. And he is out at first. Sweeney, 0 for 1 to this point. Fly it out his last at bat. One out, nobody on base. Smash to the shortstop. And Uribe makes the grab. Quinn 
and he is one for one today. Doubled last time up. There are two outs. Base is empty. Chopped hard to the second baseman. Hampton plays it off the bounce. We played four. We are tied at zero. Now those uniforms look a little tight. You gotta use cold water. Well, that's what helps bring all those pretty girls out to the park, I suppose. And here comes the bat at the plate to lead off the inning. Japan, the wind up. And he doesn't take the bait on the pitch away. Uh, good thing he didn't swing at that one, Tim. That was terrible. Got under that one into foul territory. And now the pitch. Line foul. Strikes. Look at the smile on that pitcher's face. One out, nobody on base. Number 27, Todd Hollingsworth. The ball is lined over the second baseman's head. And he puts it away. Two outs, nobody on base. Number two, Jose Ortiz. He couldn't hold up. Now he's in the hole 0 and 1. Jimmy, the problem is right now, this guy's head is not in the game. He's watching something in the stands. He's, he might as well be watching Hogan's heroes. This guy is out to lunch. Drives one to left field. And now block. With a hot dog move for the out. What are, you, what, what are you talking about? After that half inning of play, we are tied at zero. Hey, hey, what the heck? Did somebody uh, spill something on my chair? Because I hope so, because I'm sitting in a puddle of something. Random, one for one this game. Doubled last time up. And he doesn't take the bait on that one. Now, he's been very patient at the plate. Last week, it was a different story, but he seems to have calmed down a little bit. Hit sharply into right center. Walker will field it on the bounce. And he is safe at first. Ibanez, nothing doing today. Fly out his last at bat. No outs and a man on. Stands in. Ibanez takes a strike, 0-1. You no, know, this fellow might want to study that Zen, because in Zen it's Chinese, it's when you unhit the ball. Releases, and a great big swing comes up empty. Man, oh man. Hit hard into left field. Randa, rounding second. Randa, now rounding third. The Royals go up on top. Guns it to third. And he beats the throw. Maine, 0 for 1 thus far. Fly it out his last at bat. No outs, man on third. Hit right back to the pitcher. And Hampton pulls it in. Only one out, and they've got a man on third. It's under it, and that'll go foul. Elisea takes a strike. The count is 0-2. He's really got to concentrate. That was a great pitch. He just let one get by him. Gets under it, center field. 
Pierre picks it up. The Royals widen their lead. And Alisea is on with a single. One out, man on first. Knobloch gets ready. And he runs one over the shortstop. Oh, how did he catch that one? Guns it to first. He's in there safely. Perez, 0 for 2 on the day. Flyed out his last at bat. Two outs, a man on base. Fools him with that one. You know, when this guy came up, Jimmy, everyone talked about the power in his legs, the power to drive the ball, but, you know, he's trying to use his neck too much right now. He's, he's got his neck hunched over there, and that's uh, he's got to get back to his legs. Drives that one to center field. And Pierre makes the grab for the final out. And that ends the inning. And so, at the end of the inning, the Royals lead by two. Now, someone super glued my keyhole last night, Jimmy. He'll what? My keyhole, Jimmy. The door. Yeah, I had to sleep in the work shed again. I think it's those twins who moved in across the street. And here comes the batter to lead things off this inning. Ever since I lectured them about not cutting through the driveway, there has been big trouble. Japan, the windup. Norton takes a cold strike. He swings at all the bad ones and he freezes like an Eskimo ice cube at the perfect pitch. What? Japan with the windup. And he couldn't lay off of that one. He swung on to that one. That one is out of here. And Norton narrows the deficit to one. Now he's seeing the ball extremely well. That was a good pitch. He just read it all the way. Wow. What a shot. He got it right on the sweet spot, Tim. I bet it felt like a hot knife going through butter. And he hit the ball awfully hard. I thought it was going to go even further than it did, Jim. Nevertheless, he'll he'll take his little home run trot. Looked like someone caught the ball out there. That's a scary thing when uh, that ball's coming at you in the stands. People start jumping all over you. Patrick, nothing doing today. Fly it out his last at bat. No outs. Base is empty. Patrick takes a cold strike. Owen wants the count. I tell you, he didn't miss it. It's a uh, person playing this game, not hitting the swing button. Delivers. Hits sharply over the shortstop, and he'll make the play. He had an easy catch there. One out. Nobody on base. Fires, got under that one to center field. And Beltran makes the play look difficult. Two outs, nobody on base. Hit hard, first base. Uribe, rounds first. Throws to second. He is safe. And he dropped the ball. There are two outs. Runner on second. The pitch. This one has a chance. And it does. Touch them all. It's a home run. And Walker gives his team the lead. He ripped the seams off that one. He just hung up there a little bit over the plate, and he hit it like a pinata. In my day, the fences were out at 450 feet. Not too many cheap home runs back there, Timmy. When you give up a home run like that, you gotta come right back and uh, get the next guy. Forget about it. You screwed up. Everyone makes mistakes. Not as big as that one, though. I'll tell you what. Huh? That was terrible. There are two outs. The base is empty. The pitch gets under it, right field. The play at first, safe. 
Two outs, and they've got a man on first. Number 12, Todd Zeal. Zeal stares down the pitcher. This guy has got quite an arm, huh, Jimmy? He's got huge arms, Tim. Look at that at home. And now the pitch. It's sharply, but foul. Releases. And he wasn't fooled by that pitch out of the zone. He is, he is, you can't fool this guy. Sends up a drive. And that ball goes foul. And he looks at strike three. Ah, oh, Tim, I feel for this batter. I'll tell you, he's just got to stay in there, stay focused, and he's going to be fine. With the bottom of the inning coming up, Colorado leads by one. You know, Tim, I love this ballpark because they give you a lot of ice when you order a soda. Plus, they got those mustard and ketchup pumps for your hot dogs. I don't like them packets. I'm right with you on that, partner. I couldn't agree more. It's sharply toward third, and he pulls it down. Sweeney, 0 for 2 in this game. Flyed out his last at bat. One out, nobody on base. Fly ball, right field. He makes the grab. The good fielders always seem to be in the right place at the right time. Two outs, nobody on base. Number 14, Mark Quinn. Hampton, now the windup. That curveball is devastating. Now, if you notice, Jimmy, his neck is kind of crooked. He actually collapsed all the vertebrae in his neck uh, on some rowing machine at the gym. He didn't know how to use it. There's a drive, well hit to deep center. There's a lawsuit right now, but he's, he's got to be taken out of the game. And that'll do it for this inning. After the bottom half of the inning, the Rockies lead by one. Baseball on a sunny afternoon. Is there anything better? Collinsworth, 0 for 2 on the day. Flying out his last at bat. Collinsworth takes a strike, 0 and 1. You know, Tim, his jersey's so tight, he's afraid to swing because you're going to rip his jersey in half. Supan winds up. And that's line foul. Supan, and here's the wind up. Jim, this guy's got all the goods. He could, he could go all the way. Yeah, all the way. 10 to uh, Cooperstown. Ortiz, 0 for 2 so far. Fly it out his last at bat. Cooperstown. Well, whatever. And he doesn't bite on that pitch inside. Now he's really bearing down here. That was a nice pitch to lay off. Ah, oh, great pitch. That was just sheer power. He didn't have a chance on that pitch. And he runs one over the first baseman. Quinn, and he can't get to it in time. Ortiz, rounding first. And Ortiz has a double. Norton, one for two thus far. He cranked a solo shot last time up. Norton takes a called strike to count his own one. He just had no clue on that one. Pitch on the way. Sends a blast right field. And Quinn pulls it down. And he's out at second base. And that's a double play. I don't know how you can execute a double play any better than that once you have three people out. With the bottom of the inning coming up, the Rockies lead by one. 
Jimmy, I found a great video rental place last night specialized in all the gladiator moves. Miranda, two hits and two at-bats. Single last time up. Hampton, the wind-up. Miranda ties the game with one swing of the bat. And he just absolutely crushed that ball. That was a shot. The ball just barely made it out of here. And now, Jimmy, the pitcher's talking to himself. You've got to forget about it and go after the next hitter. He should just tell himself it never happened. I mean, the second he thinks about it again, he's going to get lit off. Ibanez, one for two to this point. Tripled and scored a run his last time up. Steps in. Ibanez takes a cold strike. Owen wins the count. That was a beautiful pitch if he had pulled the trigger on that one. Hit hard right side. Throws to first. He's in there safely. No outs. Man on first. Main digs in. Good eye there on the pitch outside. Ah, uh, Tim, his hitting coach actually hits him. That's what's so unique about his hitting coach. Hits sharply second base, and he'll make the play. Ah, uh, Tim, I'll tell you, there's a textbook example how you turn a double play. And they turn the double play. Elisea, one for two thus far. A run scoring single in his last attempt. The pitch. LSA takes a cold strike. Frozen with that pitch. Fires. Hit hard left side. Hit on the line and caught by the shortstop for the out. And that'll retire the side. After the bottom half of the inning, we are tied. I took a few swings of batting practice uh, this morning, and they let me do that. And then I took a pitch right into the net. Swole up like a beehive. Patrick, 0 for 2 on the day. Flied out his last at bat. You know, Jimmy, my dad always used to put a little gasoline on a rag uh, when we got a bee sting. It, uh, it takes the bite away. Patrick takes a cold strike to count his own one. Oh, I bet he wishes he had that one back. That one had a little something extra on it, Jimmy. This kid ought to try that, uh, that uh, feng shui, because in feng shui, you gotta move, and maybe what he needs to do is move and get hit by the ball. And that way he gets in contact with him. You can kiss this one goodbye, it's gone. And Patrick puts his team ahead by one. That was a shot. Jimmy, that's what you call ripping the cover off the ball. He smacked that thing like a smack daddy. Oh, Tim, he really turned on that ball. Got the head of the bat out over the plate and just spanked it. He really took that ball for a ride. Picked up a few speeding tickets along the way. Man, that was a shot. That thing was screaming out of here. No outs. Nobody on base. Japan with the windup. Sends a blast, left field. Now block, fields this one on the bounce. The throw to first, and Pierre is on first with a single. No outs, man on first. Japan now ready. The pickoff to first, and he's back safely. Drives one, foul. Good eye on the pitch in tight. And Jimmy, he's being patient right now. Very selective, that's what you gotta do to get a hit. Hits sharply, but foul.
Hit in the air, but foul. Line foul. A quick throw to first, and he's safe. Strike three called. Oh, did he strike him on? I did he? I didn't see it. Man. Walker, and he is one for three today. A two-run home run his last time up. The throw to first, and the runner gets back in. Hit hard over the shortstop. Pierre heads for third. Round third. And Walker is on second with a double. One run is in. Pelton, one for three on the day. Single last time up. One out, and they've got a man on second. Looking for a pitch he can drive. Get in the air to center field. And Beltran puts it away. There are two outs. Runner on second. It's sharply, but foul. The throw to second, and he's back safely. Get on the line over the first baseman. Walker, now rounding third. One run is in. Zeal, rounding second. And Zeal heads into third with a triple. There are two outs, but they've got a man on third. Collinsworth steps in. Japan, the windup. Get on the line toward third. And he puts it away. After that half inning of play, Colorado leads by three. Tim, do you, uh, here's a question for you. Do you remember the first person ever to walk on the moon? Yeah, I want to say Flip Parker. For some reason, that name comes to mind, but uh, I could be wrong. Arnie, you want to check that? Now block. He's 0 for 3 thus far. Fly it out his last at bat. Sends a blast. Drifting foul. Knobloch takes a called strike. He's in the hole 0 and 2. He is spotting the balls extremely well. Hit hard right side with the leaping grab. Perez 0 for 3 at this point. Flight out has lasted bad. One out. Bases are empty. Line smash second base. He makes the grab. There are two outs. The base is empty. Just sent him to the dirt. And he's shouting something at the pitcher now. Sweeney, 0 for 3 to this point. Fly it out his last at bat. Two outs, and they've got a man on first. Delivers. Fly ball, center field. There you have it, folks. The Rockies add a W to their win column. And that's going to do it, I guess. Hope you enjoy us tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Tim Kittrow for my partner, Jimmy Shorts, saying so long, everyone.